Hello friends, this video conic sections part 9 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched conic sections part 1 to part 8. Now let's see latest rectum of ellipse. Here also the latest rectum is nothing but a line which is passing through focus perpendicular to the axis and which touches the ellipse. So CD is the LR latest rectum or AB is the LR both are same both is nothing but latest rectum CD or AB correct latest rectum is nothing but a line which is passing through focus perpendicular to axis and that touches the ellipse whose end points are on the ellipse the length of the latest rectum is 2b square by a we'll prove this so let's assume that this length is L AF length is L this is C, we know this is C. So the coordinates for C at point A will be C comma L. This will be the coordinates of point A. Also we know that E is equal to E by A. Also we know that E is equal to C by A. So C is equal to A. So we can write this also as a comma l. So the a coordinates are a comma l, right? Now since point a is part of this equation, that is x square by a square plus y square by b square is equal to one. We can put x is a and y as l. So let's do that. This becomes a square by a square by l square by b square is equal to this a square a is cancelled so l square is nothing but 1 minus e square into b square correct now again we'll see e is equal to c by a so this becomes b square Let's first find E. E square is equal to C square by A square and C square is nothing but A square minus B square by A square. This is nothing but 1 minus B square by A square. Correct? E is nothing but E square is nothing but C square by A square. C square I can write A square minus B square. So this came out to be 1 minus B square by A square. So now in this equation L square is equal to B square into 1 minus E square. So I can write B square into 1 minus E square. I can write nothing but 1 minus B square by A square. So what you get is B square into this and this cancel into B square by A square. That is B4 by A square is nothing but L square or L is B square by A. Now latest rectum, the latest rectum is nothing but 2 of L because this is L and this is also L. Total distance, total distance is LR. So this is 2L that is 2B square by A and that is our answer. Very simple what we have done, we have taken a point A and we know the coordinates of point A is A comma L. We have used this A comma L in, X, in this equation X square by A square plus Y square B square is equal to 1. And then we found the value of L. Let's take some example of ellipse. We have to find the coordinates of foci, vertices, length of major axis, minor axis, eccentricity and LR of this eclipse. So if you see this quantity is greater, x quantity is greater and y quantity is smaller. That is 25 is greater than 9. That's why this is this kind of ellipse. Correct? So this equation is nothing but x square by 5 square plus y square by 3 square is equal to 1. If you compare this e equation with this equation x square by a square plus y square by b square is equal to 1. Since 25 was greater than 9 we wrote this equation. So we can say that a is equal to 5 and b is equal to 3. This is what we can say. Now. So this equation will be something like this, this will be the ellipse, right, this will be uh, 5, 
comma 0 and this will be 0 comma 3 this will be minus 5 comma 0 and this will be this will be 0 comma minus 3 and this will be center 0 comma 0 so we have now we have to find foci also so for foci you need to find c because this is c comma 0 and this is minus c comma 0 so c square or c is equal to root of a square minus b square we know this this is nothing but root of pi square minus 3 square that is root of 25 minus 9 is equal to root of 16 is equal to 4 so c is equal to 4 so i have I'll let c is equal to 4 here so i have a b c right now i can find anything so foci is nothing but minus c comma 0 or plus minus c comma 0 that is plus minus 4 comma 0 there are foci what this is is nothing but plus minus a comma 0 we have seen here plus minus a comma 0 so that is plus minus 5 comma 0 length of major axis major axis length is nothing but 2 of a 2a that is 2 into 5 that is 10 length of minor axis length of minor axis is nothing but 2b is equal to 2 into 3 is equal to 6 eccentricity is nothing but c by a and that is nothing but 4 by 5 length of letter sectum i'll find here lr is equal to 2b square by a that is 2 into b square is equal to 3 into 3 by a is 5 that is 18 by 5 so we have found all the values first thing what we did we have seen that this is greater than this 25 is greater than 9 so we now know that this equation is all found x square by a square plus y square by b square by 1 had this equation been like this x square by 9 plus y square by 25 is equal to 1 then in that case we could have written this equation as x square by b square plus y square by a square is equal to 1 because a is always greater than b so this is also greater than b we will take one more example of ellipse we have to find the coordinates of foci in this example we have to find the coordinates of the foci vertices length of major axis and minor axis and the eccentricity of the ellipse so if you see this equation 9x square plus 4y square is equal to 36 or we'll divide this whole equation by 36 we get 9x square by 36 plus 4y square by 36 is equal to 36 by 36 or we can say x square by 4 plus y square by 9 is equal to 1 or we can say x square by 2 square plus y square by 3 square is equal to 1 so here if you see this y component is more than a component so in this case our equation is of this form x square by b square plus y square by a square is equal to please remember a is always greater than b so since this guy is greater so we will say y square by a square so this is the form of equation we have that means our ellipse is of this form this is the form for ellipse so we can say that b is equal to 2 and a is equal to 3 so from this we can say this b is equal to 2 and a is equal to 3 now find c c is nothing but the root of a square minus b square that is root of 3 square minus 2 square that is root of 9 minus 4 that is root of 5 so we got c is equal to root 5 so now we have a b and c e is nothing but c by a that is root of 5 by 3 we have found e also now let's find all the points the foci as we know is nothing but 0 comma 
c and 0 comma minus c so the foci is 0 comma plus minus c that is 0 comma plus minus root 5 this is the foci this is done what this is we know is 0 comma a and this is 0 comma minus a correct so the vertices is 0 comma plus minus a so this is nothing but 0 comma plus minus 3 this is got we have got the vertices also length of major axis is always 2a we know that major axis this length this length this complete length is always 2a because this is a this is a 2a so this becomes 2 into a that is 2 into 3 that is 6 similarly length of minor axis minor axis will always be 2b this will always be 2b that is 2 into 2 that is so thus we have got everything we have got the length we have got the focus we have got the vertices and we have got the thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.